Today we're gonna make a fidget spinner spinner out of Legos. First, we're gonna build the fidget spinner. What we're need, gonna need to do is get a fidget spinner and pry off the cap. And then what I did is I got two of these, a uh, Lego Technic, I don't know what they're called, pen holder and a cross beam. <laughs> Who knows these days? And we're gonna put it together. Yeah. We're gonna put this in here on the side that's hollower. And then we're gonna get these, put it on with the caps. Works like it. For the fidget spinner spinner, we're gonna need one hub, one large, well, small motor. One controller. I'm using, I think it's off brand, I don't know. And then we're gonna need one of these four millimeter, I think it's a millimeter, four millimeter black axle crossbeam thing. Two of these, which I don't know what they're called again. These four pins. Uh, one of those, I don't know what they're called, I'm sorry guys. Uh, one of these, three of these. One Lego tire, which has actually was from my Lego El Toro Loco. You will be able to watch that. I'll put up a uh, sh thing to show you guys if you want to watch it. And here is, there's a uh, large gear and a small gear. I don't know if they smell, but sell them anymore. But yeah, yeah, I got them somehow. But. Yeah, let's get building. Hey okay, guys, so actually this is a gear ratio, which is what makes it so fast. So technically a gear ratio is basically how the big gear spins slow and then the little gear, since it's smaller, it'll spin faster. Here we go guys, and now here's the finished product. So how we're gonna turn it on is you gotta make sure it's charged. But you're gonna switch it this way. You'll notice the blue light blinking and then you're gonna get the remote. Snap that on and so, let's put it on the fidget spinner. This part really amazed me because you can literally hear how fast it's going. Like, it sounds like a motorcycle revving. Here we go. Lego fidget spinner spinner. Bye!